Hey guys, welcome to E Times. My name is Imran Ismail, and you're watching Streaming Now. Last week I saw quite a few shows. Some I enjoyed, and some were kind of disappointing. With so many shows and streaming platform, I know it's just confusing to decide what to watch and on which platform. Let me help you from those hours of browsing and not finding anything, and then finally settling on watching Friends for the 500th time. So let's get started and let me help you decide which shows you can binge and which show you should skip. First on my list is Rocket Boys, streaming on Sony Live. It was one of the most anticipated shows starring Jim Sarab as Dr. Homi Baba and Ishwak Singh as Dr. Vikram Sarabhai. Known as a mad scientist, together they created history and helped lay the groundwork of India's atomic and research programs. The show successfully recreates moments from the past, particularly those that occurred in the pre and the post independent era. Jim and Ishwak are perfectly cast for their respective roles, but Arjun Radhakrishnan as Dr. APJ Abdul Kalam is a cherry on top. You learn how one of the most brilliant scientists of our time and the love president starts his journey. Trust me, this show is binge worthy, so do it right now. Number 2 on my list is Loop La Beta streaming on Netflix. Okay, after watching the trailer, I was really excited for this one. I felt it would be something fresh to watch and the cast is so talented. But after watching the movie, I was kind of disappointed to see the talents of Tapsi and Dahil go wasted. It's an official remake of the cult German hit Run La La Run. Making a remake is always a risk for the producers as it ends up getting compared with the original. I will say it was a good attempt in making this film. The cast is so good, but it fell short on how the story is being told. Too many flashbacks ruins the whole movie. Topsy for some reason is running the entire movie. I would say you can give Loop Lapeta a one-time watch or in my opinion, just skip it. Number 3 Pam and Tom is streaming on Disney Plus Hotstar. It follows the story of Pamela Anderson played by Lily James and Tommy Lee played by Marvel's Winter Soldier Sebastian Stan. The story is about Pam and Tommy's relationship, going back to the world whirling romance that started with them marrying after only knowing each other for 96 hours back in 1995. With three episodes out now for about 40 to 52 minutes each, is a scandalous look into the wildlife of actress Pamela Anderson and musician Tommy Lee. The show cleverly explores the invasion of privacy, celebrity life, and the rise of internet. I would say give this show a try, it's worth it and it's something new. Number 4 The Great Indian Murder streaming on Disney Plus Hotstar. Starring Pratik Gandhi, Richard Chadda, and Ashidosh Rana is a crime mystery drama web series directed by Thigman Shadulia. The 9 part series is based on Vikas Saurabh's 2016 novel Six Suspects. It's a fabulous adaptation of the novel and its narrative is sure to keep you on the edge and keeps you guessing who done it. Pratik Gandhi delivers a fine performance as a CBI officer Suraj Yadav. Richard Chadda, Ashutosh Rana, along with the entire ensemble cast, do their part as expected. The series makes a compelling watch for its suspense, drama, and excellent performances by the entire ensemble cast. I would say this show is binge worthy, so do it. Last in my list is the Tinder Swindler streaming on Netflix. It's a story about group of women who were the victim of dating app based swindler, joined together in an attempt to hunt him down and recover the millions of dollars that were stolen from them. The two-hour film, based on the real-life event of a serial froster, tells a scandal-based documentary which is recounted through shocking yet heartbreaking stories of three of the many women who fell victim to this tender trickster. It is estimated that he swindled over $10 million from people across the globe. It is a sad story but it makes a good watch, so I would say give it a try. So that's it guys, these are a few shows and movies that you can stream this week. I will be back next week with some more recommendations and help you decide which show you can binge and which show you should skip. Please let us know in the comment below which shows are you currently binge watching. Till then, this is Imran Smile signing off. You keep watching E-Times.